my name is uh, Christian Leitner and I'm the territory manager within LMI Technologies for the Eastern Middle European area. At this year's control show, we are presenting a couple of our latest sensors. The GoCater 3504, our smart vision accelerator, the GoMax, our latest laser-based triangulation sensors, the 2500 series, and a new model specifically designed for glass and other speckle objects that's called the 2512. Hi, I'm Len Chamberlain. I'm the Vice President of Sales for LMI Technologies. This year at the Control Show, we're really excited to announce the GoCater 2512. The 2512 is the newest member of the GoCater 2500 series, which is blue class two lasers, two megapixel, and ultra high speed. Um, the, the 2500 series can attain speeds of 10 kilohertz and still perform the measurement functions on board the sensor just like the remainder of the GoCater family. What is special about the GoCater 2512 is its ability to pick up high fidelity data on glass surfaces, highly specular surfaces, and really difficult to scan surfaces like a transparent glue bead, which is what we're showing here today. Um, in those sorts of applications, uh, the control of the glue bead is fundamental to the quality of the product, and it is a difficult process to control. So the 2512 gives the manufacturer an opportunity to make sure their process is under control, monitor the amount of uh, glue that's being applied to a surface, monitor the amount and position as to where the glue bead is being applied and really improve the quality of their product. Hi, my name is Marion Zitko and I'm Field Application Engineer at LMI Technologies. With this demo, we would like to show you how easy the communication between the GoCator and the Universal Robot is. We developed a URCOP plugin to work with Universal Robot, but we are also able to work with many other robot companies like KUKA, ABB, FANU. With this demo, we would like to show you a very common application for the automotive industry where we take several scans of a part, then we stitch the part together to get only one point cloud. Then with our measurement tool, we are able to check the shape, the depth and the size of the feature of the parts. The GoCator 3210 in combination with the robot is commonly used in the automotive industry, aerospace or end of farm application. For more application about the GoCator in combination with the robot, you can visit our website at lmi3d.com. My name is Stefan Prange, I'm the general manager from Algona GmbH. Well, we work together with the LMI for a longer time already. We started with the microcut system, now changing more and more into the GoCater system. And we are really, really surprised how strong and how fast this product is. Well, the GoCater, of course, all we know. We have the point, we have the line and we have the snapshot uh, sensor. And uh, the good point of the GoCater is that everything is inside the head. This is important. So we do not need an external PC. We have all the logic, all the technology, all the power of PC system inside the head. And we can easily adjust and program the whole sensor with a uh, standard uh, explorer, Internet Explorer, for example, and can adjust the system. And finally, it can work standalone. It's really perfect. At this demonstration, we are showing a multi-sensor network and our smart vision accelerator, the GOMEX. So what happens here is we have uh, four sensors in a ring configuration that uh, project the laser line around the target so that we cover the product entirely. And while it's passing through the sensors, we get a full 3D point cloud and the data is streamed to the GOMEX which contains an NVIDIA Jetson board to speed up uh, the processing, which means we can reach here speeds up to six kilohertz. So it's a simple, easy and fast. So if we catch your interest on today's control show, then you can easily go to our website and check out our software with our online emulator, where you can uh, play around in our software on pre-scanned examples. So thank you very much for visiting us and stay tuned for what's coming next.